We live in a truly exciting era. Mankind is discovering new things all the time. Sometimes we find them right under our noses and in the most unlikely places. What if all we ever needed to do to make our car engines more efficient was to vaporize the fuel using the exhaust from the engine itself? It sounds simple, but all the great discoveries, from the revelation that the world was round to the principles of flight itself, have come from simple observations of the world around us. The film you're about to see could change your thinking about the way we could be using energy in America. We call it your declaration of energy independence because you can gain energy independence whether or not everybody else does. It's completely up to you. Better World Technologies and Dutchman Enterprises are working together on a new and exciting way to modify car engines. You may have a hard time believing what you're about to see, but it's true. There's some very exciting research going on at this compound in New Jersey, and also at a second facility in the Detroit area. Let's go inside and take a look. Here we are at the facility where an exciting engine modification process has been developed these guys are going to run this little internal combustion machine on some rather unusual fuel just to prove that it can be done. Imagine running your engine on pickle juice or Coke or Pepsi or anything liquid. Now for the viewer to get the idea of how amazing the technology is, they'll do a demonstration with their portable engine. Mechanically, it's just like the one you have in your car. First, they'll mix a rather unusual fuel mixture. They start off with a little gas to have some carbon to start the engine. To this, they will add Pepsi. I think that it's the law that if you use Pepsi, you have to also use Coke. And they can also put in coffee or Frappuccino. Also some pickle juice, hot sauce, soy sauce, ketchup for the kids, barbecue sauce, A1 sauce, anything liquid. Now for something truly amazing. If they put this black oil in with your fuel, your car would smoke like a flak machine from World War II. Let's put a good shot of this in. Hey, did you ever put sugar in someone else's gas tank? Well, I hope not, but I'm sure you never put it in your own gas tank. What would happen if you put sugar in the fuel tank of your unmodified car? Well, it would freeze up the engine right there and then. But let's put a healthy dose of sugar in this engine. One final ingredient is aqua velva after shave lotion. The reason for this is because one of these guys will put his face down here where the exhaust comes out and breathe the exhaust from this engine. And we do want it to smell nice. Do not attempt to do what you're about to see with your unmodified car. 